Hi Scorpio, it's Elle here to do your June 18th through July 1st reading. It's a bi-weekly read, so um, these are messages that will go for two weeks or things have already happened or they will happen. Time is fluid when we're doing tarot and we're talking about uh, tarot card readings, okay? First row is love and romance, five card advice spread second row is career and finance and then we have three cards of additional support i have prayed and meditated over the cards off camera uh find me on instago instagram um at my website below tarotofl.com shoot me an email that email address is below also thank you to those who have liked shared comment subscribed it's much appreciated all right let's go this is uh, where Scorpio is in love. Ten of water. Nice. The highest level of happiness. Just where you are. It's your energy. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Sitting pretty. Just happy. You found happiness. That's a beautiful thing. Uh, are you on your correct path? To a fire. Says, okay, you might be making some decision to... Uh, some active decision movement toward maybe a new path uh, maybe in regards to a fire sign Aries Sagittarius Leo uh, your obstacle here is the hanged man um, you're waiting for enlightenment you're waiting for another a shoe to drop in this situation you know that you need to chart a new path here it, it's an option here but you haven't fully gone in that in that way this is also Pisces I mean you can be dealing with Pisces um what's helping you eight of fire nice things moving fast this rapid communication you're getting things done it might be communication in regards to maybe trouble in a relationship um it could be loving communication also the arrows of love there's rapid movement there's movement though. okay I just went into a sneezing fit okay and I'm back all right and how can progress be made you the death card transformation let something in let it transform what do you it's up to you you know are you gonna let this energy transform or do you just want to be done with it all whatever you choose you choose to do Scorpio it seems like you're gonna be sitting pretty with it I mean you're okay with it you're happy right now some of you are waiting for somebody to do one more damn thing okay and, and you are going to put an end into this situation so quick because they're the eight of fire and then the death card say something else do something else you find out something's going on yeah that's all you need and in the midst of this you, you i mean you're happy Hmm. the bottom of the deck for love is the messenger of fire yeah? we're dealing with a fire sign somebody who hmm, is having a hard time committing they're so passionate about everything that they like everything that they want the passion dies quickly rapidly with this person um they're alluring they're attractive they're beautiful they're charismatic but they just at most times they're not there to stay all right so let's do career and finance the knight of cups is right where you are okay something your creativity is sparked here whatever you do for a living your emotions are stirred in it you love it are you in your correct path the high priestess says yes it says um 
you sought out that information that you needed to know to be on that correct path to refocus or redirect yourself. Hmm. Your obstacle here is the ten of rods. So lay down what is a burden. Could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Lay down what is burden burdensome. And it might be an old way of doing your work, an old position, taking on too many activities, too many tasks, lay some things down. And it looks like you may very well be doing that. What's helping you is the Seven of Pentacles. You've invested in something, you've put time, energy, money, love into something, into in regards to your career and finances. And uh, you're just waiting for that investment to grow, to actually have a return on your investment. To be putting the time in, in at a certain company. How can progress be made? The death card again. You. Wow. That's, that is, that's pretty big. Let something in or let it transform. What you doing? And with the ten of rods here, you're either gonna let this old way of doing something or making money in, or you're gonna find a new way to do it. A a new. Are you gonna transform the energy? bottom of the deck the king of rods some of you definitely dealing with the fire sign Sagittarius Leo here Aries they want what they want they get what they want they're after their wants first the desire and it, for some of you it could be you need to let an old way of of how you made money a career path die some of you want to be entrepreneurs you're, you're wanting that you put the time into researching that and to put money somewhere into bettering your or gaining further knowledge into whatever it is you're trying to do and um, the cards are saying hey the time is now you've got the death card twice you're on your you you're showing up big meaning this is you all right <laughs> Y'all don't even want me to show you this. Self-employment. Like I said, some of you, it's so evident here. Like, then with the King of Rods, you just, if self-employment is what's been on your heart, your mind, the cards say yes, 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 yes. They're backing you on this. It's going to happen. It must happen. This is the time. That's beautiful. Parental care. Okay, some of you got to go backwards. Some of you are caring for parents. Some of you feel like a parent. And you, and you might not be a parent. Parental care. Um, yeah, you're either going backwards and caring for parents. Or you are a parent and you need to enact a little bit more parental care. Might be a little loose with parenting maybe due to the fact that there there's some things changing evolving in your life courage wow yes have the courage to enact this change to start that business to put your foot out there um in regards to self-employment and the things that you've invested in or the people okay uh, at the bottom of the deck self-care nice um, definitely you may be working so hard you may want something so bad that you are not enacting self care you have forgotten about self don't forget about self because you're the only one pretty much primarily thinking about you mm. so self care is highlighted take some time for yourself whatever that looks like for you this is a nice reading, Scorpio. It's, it's very beautiful, um, especially in career and finance. Um, it looks like 
in love it's just you know you're you're at a place of it can go either way you're happy you're like I I'm not being moved away from this the ten of cups beautiful beautiful if you feel like this resonated with you request a person reading especially about the self-employment to see how this pans out for you um go over to my website book your own reading remember you book your reading there at the website the calendar date does not matter you can choose any date uh you will receive your reading in four business days from the time you book business days do not include saturday or sunday all right so remember calendar doesn't matter calendar doesn't matter calendar doesn't matter for business days all right um remember scorpio when in doubt pray i am praying for you guys pray for me as well um this is absolutely i'm you know i love to see this car it's beautiful and um i'm excited for you guys and i and i pray that this works out well for you all right so take care and look out for i'm gonna try to do a quick love spread for everyone but it is 12 signs and i do have a life so i don't know thank you for liking sharing commenting and subscribing if you can't request a personal reading please do what is free what is free is clicking that like button right now subscribing to the channel um commenting for my commenters i'm going to choose two random commenters and give them a five minute free reading all right it's going to happen in the next two weeks okay so get those comments up all right even if it's the comment just to say hi anyhow take care guys bye for now